Hello traders, this is Fawad Razakzada, Market Analyst for City Index. Today is the 28th of September 2023. So not a lot has changed today. Uh, yields are continuing to rise across the board. This is the US 10-year yields rising to 4.65%, extending its gains uh, from earlier this week. This is obviously not good for gold because it uh, increases the opportunity cost of holding gold and it is deemed to be positive for the dollar. Now, the markets did bounce off their lows on Wednesday with the Nasdaq uh, showing a positive close. But like the previous occasion, there seems to be no upside follow through. So if we get a, a bearish candle like we did on Tuesday uh, following Monday's bounce, then that could be quite significant as it will move us below this key support area that uh, had provided support for the Nasdaq in the last several months. So a break below that would uh, could pave the way for further technical selling, uh, especially given that the bullish trend line has already been broken down and uh, some key support levels are also giving way. In the FX space, then uh, we're looking at the euro dollar here. The euro dollar has bounced off uh, the 105 key level, a level which we had been highlighting previously as a support zone um, this is uh, a technical bounce above all uh, because we haven't seen any improvement in eurozone data or any significant deterioration in us data to suggest that uh, the euro dollar has, has bottomed out so um, the downward trend could resume once this uh, counter trend move fades for more market insights make sure to check out the news and analysis section at city index dot com